Are you tired of messing up your edits and missing your shots? These settings could fix that and make you play like a pro. Today, we're trying the pro player Reed's controller settings that have earned him over $200,000. Stick around to the end to see if these settings are actually good or not, because I'll be rating them for aiming, building, and editing. But in order for me to give this a fair rating, I have to try this out in different game modes and situations. Starting with the speed realistic 1v1. Here we can get a good first look on these settings, and our goal is to win this. Crack. Dead. Bro, first impressions, I don't know, these feel really slow because these are exponential settings. Cracked. Dead. 200, okay, for aiming, bro, these are actually nice. Oh, shit, what up? I'm not missing a shot on this. Oh my god, bro, he just destroyed my ass. Yeah. Oh, okay, let's go. I think we did get the dog. Next, we're trying this out in Tilted Zone Wars, and we're gonna focus on aiming. Let's try and get a win. Full box. Dead. Full box. 185. Huh? Bro, I see not dead. Oh, hello? When it comes to... Sh what the fuck? Yo, let me speak, my boy. When it comes to shotgun aim, I feel like these are actually mad good. Holy shit. Cracked. No, what did I just do? Okay, he's dead. One way one, come on. No mats though. I'm about to lose this, bro. I actually just lost that. Time to lock in. Nah, that was a nasty box. I just put that kid in. Holy shit, get wrecked. Why did I just say get wrecked, bro? Oh my god, just got aimed by it, bro. There we go. We got the dog. Then, of course, we gotta try this out in a one v one to see how good these are for building and editing. First to get three kills is the winner. Full box. Dead. 99. Full box. Dead. Oh my God. Door edits go crazy. Box. Ooh, that was kind of nice. And there we go. That's three kills. Here we have Reed's controller settings. And there's a couple things I really want to dive into. All this stuff here, including the slide hold time, is fine. There's nothing wrong with that. He does not use the quick weapon beta mode. He uses 1.7 build and edit mode, which is good, actually. And for his normal sensitivity, he uses 50 and 60%. I just don't like how one is 50 and one is 60. My movement just felt inconsistent. He does not use any of the boosts here. And the next thing I want to address is his ADS look horizontal speed. It's 16%, which felt super high in game. It was actually hard for me to hit my shots my AR when aiming in. He doesn't use any boost on those either, and his look dampening time is 0%. Next thing we have here is look input curve, and he actually uses exponential. MS is strength 100%, of course. Gotta get that aim button. And then his controller dead zones are 6% for each side. These are a little too low, in my opinion. A lot of controllers have stick drift. So with that being said, I'm gonna rate these settings. For the overall aiming score, I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10. Now, when it came to the editing, my edits were a little too slow. It just didn't feel snappy and good like I usually do. So I'm gonna rate the edits for these settings a 4 out of 10. Building as well, the same thing. I'm gonna give it a 4 out of 10 as well. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Also, if you wanna see me try money maker settings, then click on this video right here. See you in my next video. 